Which of these is the name of a river in Dorset? A. Piddle. B. Riddle. C. Whiddle. You've put Piddle. Probably Riddle now I think about it, but I thought Piddle was, you know, Whiddle too much. But Piddle's the same, yeah. No, I've changed my mind now, I think it's Riddle. <laughs> Correct answer is. It's the River Piddle. Yes. Step closer to home. Chaser has put. Well played. Goes also with Piddle. So the only reason I went for that, Toll Puddle Martyrs were from Dorset. Yep. So I just thought Puddle, Piddle. Here's your next question. <sighs> what was the last ruling dynasty of Russia? A, the Ifanov. B, Gudanov. C, Romanov. You've put Ivanov. There's a play called Ivanov, and I'm, I'm going on that. But... Correct answer is... The Romanovs were the last ruling dynasty of Russia. You're staying where you are. Chaser has put, you'll get this, yeah. and start to close the gap. Nicholas II. Very good, Bradley. Do you remember a film called Nicholas and Alexandra? With okay. Tom Baker as Rasputin. I watched yes. that film as a kid, and so a lot of the details are imprinted on my memory. But the Russian Revolution deposed and assassinated the last ruling member of the Romanov dynasty, Nicholas II. Right. And his entire family. OK. Here's your next question. <sighs> Which actress starred in the film version of the Joanne Harris novel, Chocolat? A. Audrey Tatou. B. Marion Cotillard. Or C. Juliette Binoche. <laughs> You've put... Juliette Binoche. Yeah, with Johnny Depp, I think. Yeah. I think so. Correct answer is... Very good. Step closer to home. Chaser has put... Goes right with Juliette Binoche also and remains the two behind the three from home. Audrey Tattoo is the actress who was famously in Amelie and Marion Cotillard is the French actress who made her name playing Edith Piaf in La Vie en Rose. Thank you very much. Here's your next question. In the Jungle Book, what type of snake is car? A, an adder, B, king cobra, or C, a rock python. You've put rock python. It's between B and C. But I think he wraps around people. Python do that, don't they? More that he's not a hissing cobra, he's a slithery, slimy thing. Correct answer okay. is... Rock Python, well played. Step close at home. Chaser has put. Wouldn't I got that? Yes! Not in a million years where I got that. I thought it was a King Cobra all the way. Really did. There you are. Brilliant. Well played, you. With three in front, two from home. Here's your question. What classic board game includes a bathtub, a thingamajig, and a cage? A. Operation. B. The Game of Life. C. Mousetrap. Jenny Graham. You've put. Mousetrap. I love yeah, that game. Great game. Great game. And so, the, the bathtub I remember the most out of those. It's a bit Heath Robinson, isn't it? When all the thing going there, you can do. Yeah, it's brilliant. Yeah, yeah, it's great. It takes ages to set up. It does. It's good. Correct answer is. Brilliant. Mousetrap is right. Step close home. Chaser has put. Goes also with a mousetrap. The only one of those games I've ever played was Operation. Uh, six hours a day between the ages of 10 and 14 <laughs> under the orders of my parents. <laughs> <laughs> All right, we're one from home. Here's your next question. If an object is described as sagittate, what shape is it? A, arrow-shaped, B, crab-shaped, C, heart-shaped. <laughs> Need an answer. You've put arrow-shaped. I was thinking about Sagittarius, and obviously that's not crab, because that's Cancer the Crab, and heart and arrow. I just, is, is Sagittarius the archer? I'm not sure. 5,000 pounds. If this is right, we are through. Nick, correct answer is... We could have gone for 53 grand here, I reckon. Oh. I'll tell you what, I think we could. Crab, you're right, I'm not sure. Oh, what an answer that was. Yeah. What an answer that was. Can anyone tell he's got a background in theatre? Um, so, 
that was very, very well played, I've got to say. You say people underestimate you. I was guilty of that. I didn't think you'd be up to much until you stepped up and got all those questions right. Uh, and you are exactly what Phil needs. I mean, yeah, you're quite right. They could do with a female player in the team, but they've got youth and experience there. Uh, and so it's going to be a good team. Look forward to it. Absolutely. Nick, well played, mate. Thank you. Congratulations. Let's do it. Well done.